welcome back to episode two. Everyone liked the first one, so let's continue this little series we got going on. Today is a little bit uh, not so nice out, so have a warm tea today. Excellent. So, first thing, you guys saw that the shelves were bare. We've experienced a lot of ordering recently, and I mean, it is what it is. We're running low on stock. However, we got great news. We have skids showing up today. So that's going to help restock things. We have more shipments coming next week. What else we got today? 116 orders to do, 20 emails. Amy's going to be coming by in about an hour or so, so she's going to be a tremendous help with that. All of this Hello Kitty stuff needs to go out. So that's another thing. Boneyard, wow, that sold out quick. When that video went out, it started disappearing really fast. Two perfect grades, perfect strike Gundams, which are here and here. If you have any questions or anything, or you want additional pictures or whatever, just send us text message, Facebook message, which the two individuals did. They just wanted to get clarification, more pictures. One of them I sent pictures, the other one I sent the video. They bought it right away, so great deal for them. So let's go start picking. Got the iPad here. I'm gonna shut up this time because I was talking too much before, so. Let's get started. Okay, first thing we need is boxes. More boxes from the Jeep Grand Cherokee here. Oh. You might be asking yourself, hey, Pat, where do we keep the smaller boxes? Oh, well, you repurpose this BMW for the smaller boxes. If you want to know how long it's been since this vehicle's moved because of what's happening here in Canada, there's your answer. All right, so Amy just arrived. Say hello. Hey guys. So I pulled out all of these orders while she was not here. It kind of snakes around. Some Hello Kitties in there. And then just over here. So these are the ones I pulled out so far. How many orders do we have? We, wow, we have 117 orders. All right, so you ready to get started? Busy day, I'm ready. So, from the last video, Kale emailed us and said that we could use his order in the next video. So, let's get this one packaged. Well, this one just came in and uh, doesn't really have a spot yet, so. Here's Kale's order. We just bring it over to the main office. Amy? Yes. Kale from Ontario. All right. Up here, let's just double check everything. Awesome. We're done. All right, from Kiri, Prince Edward Island. We got five items. All right, here's the order. So we're just bringing it over to the office. Whoops, it's a bit of a balancing act. All right, this is going to Kiri, Prince Edward Island. Prince Edward Island, all right, let's do this. All right, so we're just gonna print the label here, expedited shipping. It's going to arrive in five business days, all the way to PEI in just five days. Hey, Kiri, your package is coming. So I pulled out the next batch. Amy's already taking care of the ones that are uh, that open spot there. We got all of these ones to do. And these ones, we're still pulling them. These ones are already done. And how many do we have left? We have 67 to go. 67 to go. Good news skid has just arrived uh it's only one skid so that concerns me a little bit i was expecting a little bit more but it could be on a different shipment we're watching this through uh one of the cameras it's a two-way camera so we can actually communicate with the outside world if we wanted to at this time we are limiting contact with the outside world just because we ship all across canada and we don't want to get infected or spread any infections so we're going to leave the skid out here for a few hours we'll take a look at it shortly for those that are interested we got one skid, 27 toys, which refers to boxes. So it looks like we just got the one skid today. It's like Christmas, so once a week here, it's uh, it's absolutely amazing. 
some more perfect strike gundam all right so far it doesn't look like there's much damage well any damage oh more of the fads oh looky looky some hello kitties looks like a box of 24. everything's looking good looking good oh looks like more hello kitties wow this skit actually came really nice deep striker oh more hello kitties wow so let's get this skid inside and get it unpacked so we were just about out of action bases and not anymore PG red frame now back in stock so I just wanted to show off this order nine clear action bases here's the box here and I believe these come with ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, nine, ten. perfect this is actually a pretty killer order with the nine action bases. They're going to, I believe it's Nova Scotia. And he actually managed to get the lupus damage box too. So good for you, sir. The struggle is real. All right, so next up, we actually have Prime 92's order. He's got a YouTube page where he actually builds these Gundams uh, through the video. So if you want to check out any of these Gundams, check out his page. We will link it down below. So here are one of the Boneyard kits from the previous video. First one ended up going to someone's private warehouse. And the second one is going out today. If you remember, it had this much damage. The kit's fine inside, it's just the box. So this is going on its own. Slip it in and on away it goes. So here are the majority of the orders. We still have a few downstairs that we need to bring up. We just wanted to get them ready for Canada Post. Odds are if you've ordered this weekend, your order is somewhere in the midst of this. Canada Post just arrived to take these parcels to their destinations. The best part of waking up is iced tea in your cup. All right, today's April 1st, so we kind of missed a day in there. Just to give you a recap, we did 84. I have my sheet here again, I have a little cheat sheet from Canada Post. We did 84 packages that were shipped out, and we spent roughly $1,347. That's actually really high, but I mean, we did ship out a lot of stuff. So anybody knows why a brother printer resets every three hours, let me know. So today we got 44 emails, 44 emails. We got 44 orders, 25 emails. We also have a small shipment coming in. So the last shipment that you saw was not nowhere near as big as I was expecting. Our huge one is actually showing up next week. It's about 20,000 wholesale. So it's gonna be a great video. It's like Christmas times two, and we're gonna be stocking a lot of things that haven't been stocked in a long time. I hope that made sense. All right, but enough talking. Let me grab my iPad, let's get to picking and get these orders shipped out. Amy should be arriving in the next, I would say hour. So let's get started. So Amy has arrived and how many orders do we have? We have 46. All right, so that's two more than what we started with, but uh, where are they going? They're going all across Canada. <laughs> so let's take a look at these orders here that I pulled. You might be able to spot, they're kind of, the one standing up and sitting down is kind of like one order and then another. So maybe you'll be able to spot yours if you've ordered either today or last night. Oops, almost fell over. All right, ready to get started? Let's go. Also, common thing that we're seeing in the emails is please double check your address, especially your, if you live in an apartment or condo or something or townhouse or whatever it may be, please make sure that you write your apartment number down. We currently have two or three packages on their way back that forgot apartment numbers. I have reached out. Uh, we do have a contact, a commercial contact at Canada Post that is 
frantically trying to redirect these packages so they don't actually show up back here. They'll kind of stop halfway and then start heading back with the correct information. A lot of the times they come back here, then we have to ship them back out. A two to, th two to five day process ends up taking 10, 15 days just because of a missing piece of whether it could be your postal code or your address. Just double check before you place your order because this will really help you get your package quickly and efficiently. And last thing you want is your package going to say your uh, house is 15 and it goes to 150 down the street and it's just gone at that point. Double check your address, very important. So we're coming to our first casualty of the new order. It's just this little guy. So it's not too bad. It's a lot less than I was expecting, so. And we got a few more kitties. So some top coat. Needed to restock that. And what do we got here? Back in stock. All right, well, this is a pleasant surprise. Got this today. I already opened it because I uh, needed to see what it was, but it's from the Good Smile Company and wrapped in tissue as well. Let's see if we can back up here a little bit. Perfect. It's still hard to grab. Let's grab it on this side. Look at that. Not sure if you can see that. Maybe. Escafone. I think I'm saying that right. I remember this cartoon when I was a kid. Had no idea what it was about. I could only get a limited number of these. I'm not sure how many we got left since the pre-order, but if you do want one, grab it. And it looks like Canada Post has just arrived. All right, so pretty much that's it. Nothing too crazy today. Everything is pretty calm. Everything was pretty chill. Boneyard stuff, we ended up getting four items from both days. Uh, nothing too crazy here. Just, you know, this guy, I think I showed you this earlier. It's damaged all over. This guy we found is crushed on both sides. This one, what's wrong with this one? This one's messed up over here. It's, you know, it's got some damage. And same one again, except this one is all messed up. It's probably not gonna show up on camera. Oh, there's a little, but it's on the front and everything like that. So those are gonna be on probably beginning of next week in the boneyard. So if you guys uh, want any of those, you know where to find them. If you guys want to know more about the business, comment down below. You can ask me anything. I'll try and get all the answers out in the next video. There is going to be really cool stuff. We got skids, all kinds of exciting things happening next week. So hopefully I can get a video up next week for that. Also, if you want to be in the next video, shoot us your order reference number to info at CanadianGundam.com and who knows, you might be in the next video. Need advice, Gunpla, accessories, paints, whatever? Why ask me? I'm one person. Go to the Facebook group, Gunpla Network. They got 30,000 plus people waiting to help you out. And it's an awesome community, especially in times like this. Go check them out. Also, here, let me move you over here for this one. Let's get some stuff out of the way. I'll also tell you about a story. It's a dark one. It happened a little while back. The dark story of the Leos. So, I might make that a separate video. It's quite depressing. Nothing that can be done about it. It's been, uh, there's been a box at the warehouse that has been sitting in the corner for quite some time. And I think I'm ready to let it go. So, cheers. <laughs>